this is my cassette collection video if you guys haven't checked out my entire vinyl collection video then go do so i'll put in the description down below or you guys could probably just click up here and then it'll take you to the vinyl collection video i have about 10 cassettes uh the cassette walkman that i use is this jensen one right here i'm not sure if you guys can see it it's supposedly stereo and i did my research on on like walkmans and stuff because i wanted a walkman i didn't really want a cassette deck i wanted a walkman just so i could take these cassettes anywhere and i found out that this was probably the best modern walkman and so that's why i got it i know no walkman is going to compare to the older walkmans and i know that i'm not going to spend too much on a walkman and too much on cassettes just because they're not the main thing i'm trying to collect so if you guys want a good walkman i'll put the link in the description down for this i haven't used it so i can't tell you guys if it's like if it's actually good or not but uh it should be the best one at least uh, if we're talking about modern walkmans but yeah let's get started this is my cassette collection let's go from the left all the way to the right uh the first cassette i ever bought was actually jesus is keen by kanye west the side here's the back it's a nice blue tape here with the uh, track list there i got this for eight dollars during black friday this album was actually uh the first album i got on vinyl and now it's the first album i got on cassette so that's pretty cool and it's one of the reasons why this album means a lot to me but yeah i can't wait to check it out on cassette i have this in all platforms i have it on cd vinyl and now i have it on cassette so pretty cool. Next one up we got here, Kanye West Yeezus. Got this one for from Amazon actually for eight dollars. It's a nice clear cassette. I mean, what can I say about this album? This album's good. Third song on here is Blood on the Leaves, which is on this side. Blood on the Leaves. Next one up we got here is After Hours, one of the best albums of 2020. Here's the side. A nice red tape. Pretty cool. That track list down there. Favorite song on here is Scared to Live. I got this one from Urban Outfitters for free, actually. So that's pretty cool. And then I got this one from, also from Urban Outfitters. This one I did pay full price for this one. Hollywood's Bleeding by Post Malone. Uh, yeah, so far I have all these three on vinyl cd and cassette so that's pretty cool this one i also have it in vinyl cd and now have it in cassette actually i bought the vinyl not too long ago so the vinyl is the most recent one but yeah it's a nice purple um tape i guess pretty cool and then we got joji like tar got this one from amazon for 15 dollars nice i want to say a clear case but uh or a clear tape but it kind of looks gray but same time clear on the sides and there's b side fair song on here is run and my favorite song on hollywood's bleeding is the intro track this album was a underrated album in 2020. I didn't see enough people talk about this album. Obviously, his fans talked about this, but like outside of his fans, I don't think anybody talked about this album, which just sucks because this album is underrated as fuck. And it's good too. Next one is What Could Possibly Go Wrong by Dominic Feike. My second favorite album of 2020. Side, if we could just focus. Okay. And it's a nice clear tape. I forgot how much I paid for this one. I think it was like around fifteen to twenty dollars. I think but worth it, honestly. Can't wait to listen to it on cassette. Limbo, Mine, one of my favorite albums of twenty twenty, and a nice green tape, solid green, lime green. You know, there's side B. Oh, yeah, I think this is a checklist, right? No, no man, that's just um, credits. But yeah, cool tape. Limbo by Mine. I don't know what we got here is Punisher, Phoebe Bridges, the only album that I have here I haven't yet listened to. Nice neon green. Probably my favorite tape that I own. It's just like like the color of it is so cool. Track list right here. I still have yet to listen to this album. I also own this album on every platform. 
Actually, all these albums except for one. Actually, two. Fine Line by Harry Styles. Here's the side. Here's the back. A nice black tape right there. And then the track list. Favorite song on here is Fallen. Such a good album, honestly. If you guys haven't checked this one out, highly, highly recommend it. And then last but not least, my most recent cassette is Wanna. Argana and a nice purple tape. This album cover is so good. I remember when it came out, a lot of people hated it, but I honestly loved it. You know, which kind of surprised me because Ghana, his album covers are like straight up ass. But this one was actually pretty good, and this album surprised me too. Like I was expecting this album to be not so good, but holy shit, this album exceeded my expectations, and that's why I do like it a lot. Actually, uh, I will consider this his best work. I'm glad I own it. I wish I owned it on vinyl, but I don't. I only own it on CD and I own it on a cassette. Hopefully, they restock the vinyl soon. Yeah, we got that. Uh, the Harry Styles one, I only own it on vinyl. I don't own this on CD. Other than that, though, all these albums I own in almost every platform. But yeah, that's my cassette collection. I'm going to be unboxing these cassettes. So stay tuned for every single unboxing of these. Let's go.